studs. And then beyond us, to our left, is when Colonel Fremont noticed the beautiful golden shimmer reflecting off the water at sunset time. It reminded him of the golden horn of Constantinople. So he called this the Golden Gate Strait. Nearly a hundred years later, this bridge was built across the Golden Gate Straits. Took four years of building, 1933 to 1937. Now the highest point on the bridge is right here at the center. This is 220 feet above the water at high tide. And that's a very important number for all of us to remember for later. 220 feet above the water at high tide. We will revisit that number when we come back from Sausalito. 220 feet above the water at high tide. Centennial souvenir. It's nice and peaceful. Beautiful. It's cool. So those are the tr things growing on them, but the, but the redwoods don't because they've got tannin, which yeah. kills off, stops the fungus and other stuff from growing. be able to tell the age of the tree by the number of rings. So, 
Did he say, take your time and breathe? This is the best oxygen in the, in the world. The trees take in all the carbon dioxide and release oxygen, so... That's where they start from, yeah. They kept the trees. Yeah, oh yeah. So some of these trees would be like 2,000 years old. I'm terrible at reading. That's, um, yeah, 1,910. That's 1,000. C before M is 900. And X is 10. Maybe the one they're standing. That one? Where they're where they're standing. This tree snapped. More than a hundred feet or seven feet down. It has wrought a crack, a forked trunk might have been a weakening factor. Now it had the valued log to the floor. Yeah, it'd be that. That's standing upright. Where they're standing, Cole? Is there a tree? Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, that's just October 7th this year, isn't it? Must be, just recently. Now it adds a valued log a month ago. to the floor and woody debris to the stream. We hope to relocate the classroom in the near future, isn't it? Isn't it, isn't it? Hang on. <laughs> this makes, this place makes quite a contrast to, um, the heart of San Francisco, all the hustle and bustle. Yeah. Oh, Crowded streetcars. So 1910, that's the same as what was on that new yeah. Roman mural. Well, there's, there's Gil Gilbert P Pinchot there. Well, that's Theodore, Theodore Roosevelt. He was the one who declared this a national yeah. monument. Yeah. So, are they, are they standing here? With that yeah. lady standing. They were standing there in 1923. Yeah. Same tree, same. At the, at the Pincho tree. Yeah, yeah, with that lady standing. So they had typewriters back in 1900. Mm.
coming up. Do you have right of way? <laughs> <laughs> okay. 